What's up guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to fix the issue when you are unable to schedule a new event using Microsoft Teams on your PC. This should be quite an easy tutorial. For more information, click on the first link in the description below. With the right account permissions, you should be able to create a new meeting or schedule an event by default. To test if this issue is related to Microsoft Teams account settings or the application, I suggest checking if you can schedule a new meeting using the Teams web app. Sign in to your current Microsoft Teams account and this will allow you to use the same interface using your browser. After making sure that you can create a new meeting using the web version, make sure to completely restart the app on your PC. In your system tray, right-click the Teams icon and select Quit. You can then relaunch the application, which should be updated automatically after the restart, and make sure that you're logged in with the correct account. When creating a new meeting, make sure to use the correct time zone and that your date and time is set correctly. You should make sure that your Teams email is added to your Outlook account. Open up your Outlook application and make sure that you're logged in with your account. Navigate to the Info tab on the top left and click on Account Settings. In the Accounts section, make sure that you're using the correct email address. Otherwise, you need to add it to the Account Information section of your Outlook settings. As a last resort, I suggest repairing and resetting the Teams app if you have admin privileges on your PC. This will only take a few seconds and resetting the application's data will additionally prevent common issues in the future. Search for Uninstall and select Add or Remove Programs. Here, filter your search by all drives and look up Teams. Click on the burger menu next to Microsoft Teams and select Advanced Options. From here, scroll down and select Repair. Next, click on Reset which will remove your custom settings and current login information. If you're able to log in with the correct account now, you should be able to schedule an event or a meeting. In case you have any further issues or problems following this tutorial, then I suggest following my extensive guide linked in the description below. I hope this helped you out, leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.